I once remember a reading where an individual told me to stop throwing temper tantrums at spirit. What you do in your privacy of your own home and with your relationship with God and spirit is between you, God and spirit. You have no right to tell anybody how they should pray. I throw a lot of temper tantrums, but it's better that I do that with them than to do it out on the street. It's okay to show frustration whether you know they're coming through or not. It's okay to be frustrated. It's okay not to feel most patient. It's okay to do those things and acknowledge those things with the higher powers. It's not okay to display that to other people on a regular basis. I still lose my patience with people. <coughs> Nothing is absolute. But the more that I express my unhappiness with the most high, the less unhappy I am in public. It's got to go somewhere. You cannot repress. I think the number one thing that a lot of you look for is to repress others. If somebody if somebody is 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 being emotionally violent to you, physically violent to you, you'll say you get what you put out if someone responds not recognizing that that person responding is the person getting back what they put out. The person who responds is not going to get nothing back unless you give it to them and you give it to them because you refuse to recognize that they're being attacked. You guys have so many double standards that cause the mental illness, that cause people not to be able to like to, to do sinister stuff. Because they've never been trained to properly release their emotion. I think that I, um, for the situation that I'm in, I think I'm pretty balanced. There's been a few people that have gotten some tongue lashes from me. Oh, really? I don't have a lot of um, disgruntles, and that's because I take it up with the most high when I'm upset. And one thing I want y'all to know is that patience is probably the most painful thing of all the virtues. You know, patience is a virtue, but it's painful. When you got the kind of stuff that I have going on in my life, it's painful. Why I got to wait for all this? I know that things are going on with my children and I just got to wait. That's painful. Why wouldn't you cry out to God? I'm fucking sitting here broke. People done stole my money. That's painful to just have to sit here and wait. You take that up with God. I love somebody and he loves me and I gotta wait for what? I said you don't understand and you feel like you've done all that you can. The only thing you can do is take that pain up with God. And how dare you tell me how to dress God about my shit? How dare you? Mind your fucking business, bitches. None of y'all is any guru. None of y'all know shit. Y'all, y'all know is repression. All y'all know is respect. There is that 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 there is no there is no such thing with God. You do not have to approach God. Excuse me, sir. Excuse me. You don't got to approach God like that. You just come as you are. Come as you are. Come how you feel. Be real. With God. If you nobody else, be real with God. And if that is a tantrum, then it's a motherfucking tantrum. 